Hi, Intermediate. Welcome to Thursday's workbook time. Get your pencil ready, and we're going to hold it just like the picture is over here. We have three fingers holding it, and this My name are J-E-N-N, -N, but I'm going to start from the skyline, drag it down to the grass line, loop it back up to the plain line. The plain line is a line that has tiny little lines with spaces in between. The rest of the letters in my name, some of you might have a name that has to go past the grass line. That is called the worm line. And that's all the way down here. All right, so let's get started. The first page that we have the diamond black. So here's my black crayon, and here are some diamonds on the ground. So the diamonds are going to be colored black. We've got quite a few on this path here. Great job. The next color we need to do, and the next shape, is the rectangle, and the rectangle is brown. Let's color those rectangles brown. Circle, some of them are holding up the circle here and holding up this boy who's sitting on the bench. Great. And now the next shape. I'm going to color it green. We've got one circle here. And we've got another circle here. And we have a lot all around. They look like balloons. Great. And writing. And some more on the path. And there's a little square circle right here on the dog. All right, the next shape that we're going to color is the triangle. So the triangle is going to be red. Ooh, we've got a couple here on the path. One on the path. And we have one up here that's like a balloon. Excellent job. The next shape to color is an oval. And that's yellow. So here's one and another and another. orange. Let's color those squares. Very good job. Actually, this one is at the top and it's a slanted square. Great work. Let's move on to the next page. We have the number six. down and loop in. Top, drag it down, loop in. Top, drag, loop in. Top, drag, loop in. Top, drag it down and loop in. Now we're going to trace the circles that are inside the boots. One, two, three. The lines for the stripes. That's one stripe, two stripes, three stripes, four stripes, five stripes, and six stripes. Excellent job. Now the next page. So let's take a look. One, two, three, four, five, and six hats. Great. The next thing to color are six socks. One, five, and six. You can use any color crayons you want. Then, at the bottom, it says to color six pairs of shoes. Now, a pair of shoes really are two shoes because you put a pair, three pair, four pairs, five pairs, and six. And the question to answer at the bottom, 
What number comes after six? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. I, Tertrace, we start at the skyline down to the grass line, put a top hat at the skyline, a bottom at the grass line. Skyline down to grass line, top across the skyline, bottom across the grass line. Skyline. Skyline, drag it down to grass line, cross over at the skyline, cross under at the grass line. Start at the top, skyline down to the grass line, drag a little line at the skyline and a little line at the grass line. We need to match the opposites. This is daytime, this is a small animal, this girl's going up, this boy's going down, this is nighttime. This is big. Well, the opposite of big is small. The opposite of If you're not going down the stairs, the opposite is going up the stairs. Excellent job drawing those lines. And then we have our page here. We need to get this butterfly through the maze. Of girl's chin. Let's see if we can find a path. We use our finger to trace. And I think we found a way. We come in where the arrow is, drag, drag it down, scoot up, drag it down, Turn, drag it some more, and go sideways and all the way up. Great work.